Hey guys, what's up? It's Monkazunky, and uh, I'm going to be showing you guys a short little guide slash review on the new item, the Charm Collector. You can buy this Charm Imp, as it's called, the Charming Imp from the Dungeoneering Shop. For 100,000 tokens, you need 21 summoning to be able to use it, but I'm sure if you have at least 100k Dungeoneering tokens, you'll probably have that level in summoning. You can also configure the Charming Imp. Um, to only pick up a certain kind of charm. For example, if you only want crimsons and blues, you can configure him to only pick up crimson and bl crimson and blue charms. And then the gold and green charms, he will crush kind of like a bone crusher, and you'll get a small amount of XP for them. I'm showing you the charm collector kind of in action here. I'm just at my Slayer task, which is Abyssal Demons. And uh, as you can see, the charms just go straight into my inventory. Um, I don't have to pick up anything at all. It just makes it really, really nice. Uh, you don't have to run around clicking on charms and wasting XP and that sort of thing. I still end up running around anyway because I like to pick up the Infernal Ashes. But um, for pe oh, and I know a lot of people that do Abyssal Demons don't pick up the Ashes. So in that case, it's going to be really nice because you'll just be able you'll be able to go from Abyssal Demon to Abyssal Demon or whatever creature you're slaying. It works with any creature that drops charms. Uh, all you need to have is the Charming Imp in your inventory. And unfortunately, he actually sends the charms into your inventory instead of into your bank, as I thought was originally going to be the plan. Uh, if he had sent them into your bank, it would have saved a bit of inventory space, but it's not the biggest deal. It just means you're going to have to use one more inventory space every time you do a Slayer task, as the Charming Imp will uh, be picking up all the charms and uh, you're going to have to keep him in your inventory if you want that to happen. So it is only 100k tokens which is 1 million engineering XP if you want to think of it that way. Um, and I got d double rune helms here. I thought that was a little cool. Um, actually the mask that I'm wearing I got from the School of Fortune. It's called the Mask of the Abyss and uh, it does a couple things. It acts as a slayer helm and it gives you a bit of bonus slayer XP while slaying abyssal demons and also it gives you like a 1 out of 10 chance to get your drop doubled. So I got quite a few times where I got um, double infernal ashes um, and in that case I got lucky and got double rune helms so that was kind of nice but um, I'm not showing all my slayer task here just a, a small little portion of it it's sped up obviously so this video wouldn't be too long and uh, the charm imp is really nice I would highly recommend getting it if you're not 99 summoning um, I am already 99 summoning however I just I really like to collect charms uh, no particular reason I just find it fun it tickles my fancy so um, yeah, hopefully this guide can be helpful to you guys. Um, I know I would highly recommend getting the Charm Amp. I, I realize that 100,000 tokens is quite a bit considering like the Bone Crusher has a similar feature and that's only about 34,000 tokens. And 1 million Dungeoneering XP, if you're not a very high level, uh, that can take a while to get. But after you get your... Um, I would recommend to the first dungeon item that you buy would probably be Chaotic Claws, or if you want to get a different Chaotic, get those first, and then after that, probably the very next thing you buy is, I would highly recommend for you to buy the Charming Imp, because this is just so nice uh, for Slayer, and really for PVM if you want to do some Glacors or TDs for Charms or anything like that. So anyway, that's going to be about all for this video. Uh, feel free to like the video if you liked it, and uh, also just let me know what you'd like to see in future videos in the comments. That's all for me today. Uh, thanks for watching my guide, and farewell.